number of confirmed COVID-19 cases in Kenya to 31. These 31 confirmed cases... Morning guys, welcome to this self-quarantine, okay, welcome to the vlogs of quarantine. I'm just, I'm running mad, okay, I'm actually running mad and it's not just because, oh, you know, people are like, I'm an introvert, I'm used to staying in, that's true, but then when I'm usually staying in the house, it's up usually after like a busy day when I just want to black out, do nothing and like watch series and do nothing else, but right now, I get to do that the whole day. <laughs> So it's getting a bit monotonous and I actually need something to do because the first few days what I was doing is I was catching up on like a year's worth of sleep you guys. It was so good like I actually slept and rested and slept and slept and slept and slept and slept and, slept and, slept and now I'm tired of sleeping. So you know i have to do other things but then i just feel weird because my day has no structure. I wake up, i shower, i change into my pajamas, stay the whole day doing absolutely nothing change back into my pajamas, you know, like into other pajamas, and then sleep. That's literally my, you know, day in the life. Day in the life would literally be me showering, waking up, pajamas, like just like that, doing nothing. And I'm tired. Like, I'm going crazy. I actually need some structure to my day. And that's what this vlog is going to be about, just like finding some structure in my life because I actually need to do other things. Otherwise, I'm going to go mad because my brain is so lazy at the moment. It doesn't want to do anything. It doesn't want to hear anything. It just wants to chill. Which is good, but it just gets monotonous. So I'm going to be finding a structure to like my day. To, I want to start working out, okay? I want to start doing my actual work that I have because I'm not doing it. I don't know. Ah, what's this? <laughs> I want to start doing the work that I have. I want to start planning for content, Instagram content, YouTube content, you know. I don't know. I'm going to find like an actual routine. I changed into working out gear so that I wouldn't have to work out in my day pajamas, you know. <laughs> You're not ready for me after quarantine. Stats. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like, do I look like Balotelli? That's what you know, Balotelli. <laughs> So here's the workout I'm currently doing, this third one, and let me tell you guys, it is hard. It is hard. I show you that you can be anything that you want to be, and you can do anything that you set your mind to. We are independent women. We yes. can do whatever we want. We don't have to be labeled. Yes. I want to do lots of things with my life. I don't have yes. to just do one thing, okay? Yeah. All right, just have a <laughs> Just had to say that, so I hope that by me supporting you with get, you guys getting your good bodies and oh. looking fit and mm. awesome and beautiful, Hallelujah. support me with my music. Literally, like I would die without you guys. Like I'm not kidding. She helped me through a lot. And I When I tell you guys I'm tired, that's an understatement. Literally, my thighs are already aching, my legs are aching. I don't even think I'll be able to walk down the stairs. Yeah, it's that bad. I don't think I've ever deserved a meal more in my life. How do other people do this? Like, why? How are we born? Are we born with different... <laughs>
my mom has like um office video call downstairs so that's why i have to eat my breakfast like upstairs as i plan my day otherwise you can't see me eating breakfast in my room hey in an african home that's almost as big as an offense as having like all the cups in your room no like you will be killed but yeah so what I want to do right now is I just want to plan my day. Um, I have a few things to do because I have to make posters for this thing that I'm doing. I have to also finish some report, uh, some part of a report um, for rape culture and all that. And then after that, I have to catch up, my duly catch up on my series. <laughs> but yeah, and then I have to wait. No, oh my God. Do I have enough hours in a day? Oh yeah. I also have to create content for Instagram, so that's going to be fun. Yeah, so I'll see you guys after I've showered and I'm starting my day. Like, actually starting, starting the work I have. I think first I'll create the content and then I'll do the posters and then I'll do the other things. Hi guys, so I'm just doing like some light makeup so that I can start taking the photos for Instagram. You know, the funny thing about content creation... <laughs> especially right now is actually literally getting cute to go nowhere like it's so bad because you you put on this makeup you look cute you take a photo then you wipe it off it's such a waste and i'm going to finish like all my makeup just doing quarantine looks but you know what it's okay it's fine because i just like looking cute <laughs> so i'm just going to bake under my eyes i hope this look comes out cute guys like Especially my hair. My hair is what I'm worried about. I'm trying to do... I watched Asiami's gold... Um, Asiami gold's tutorial today about like doing this hair thing. <laughs> wow. Okay, I haven't secured my ponytail yet. But I'm going to secure it. Here it is. I just splitted it and... I want to secure it the way she did and I'm trying to curl my hair a little bit like the way she did because I don't have a flat iron. So I'm trying to do this and then I apply heat and it's just, a, it's a struggle but we just hope <laughs> I look cute in the end and yeah, if I do, you'll see photos on Instagram and if you don't follow me on Instagram, just follow me at Tamina Samo and yeah. Guys, a little request for all like the beauty gurus. Next time when you're telling us, I hope this doesn't sound, the next time when you're telling us how you've left your eyelashes to dry, <laughs> please show us how like every time I leave my eyelashes to dry is either the glue gets on that thing and then it doesn't come onto my eye or just show us. I don't know, what technique do you guys use because am I the only one with this problem? <laughs> I'm so confused. I'm having big problems with lighting because there's a lot of lighting coming from this side and no lighting coming from this side I'm trying to capture some green over here and over here and a lot of orange <laughs> so yeah I swear this ponytail keeps falling off <laughs> okay think we're good let's get back to it Hey guys, I didn't even finish the vlog yesterday because, let me tell you, I got so mad because of all the things that were happening in Kenya. Because of, like, 
because of the curfew and if you see the videos they literally break your heart like i literally got so mad my heart was broken i was just wondering why are they beating people if you're wondering what's going on um there's a national curfew the kenyan national curfew is now 7 p.m and yesterday even before seven reached or even before six reached as people were saying like in mombasa they were beating the people who were going to the ferry they were beating i was just like why literally they were throwing tear gas at this pe- and i was just i was really heartbroken and I'm so glad today the minister um, talked about it and said that they should not be beating people. And I was just, I'm telling you, my heart is just breaking. <sighs> anyway, so today we went shopping um, for essentials. I've just come back. Hey, the, it's actually very stringent measures. Before you enter the mall, you have to wear gloves as you're are pushing your trolley around and then the weird thing was they were telling us one trolley per person so i wasn't even allowed to go in the supermarket at first they said that if i was with my mom my mom is the only one who could go but only problem is we shop differently like we always divide the things like my mom shops for foodstuffs and everything and then i shop for toiletries and they always fit in two trolleys because i don't know yeah so i wasn't allowed at first so i had to sneak in later but the good thing is i only snuck in so that i could have my own different trolley because the rules are and they kept announcing the supermarket that it should be one person per trolley so yeah i just came from the supermarket i just got a few things i'm i got at least i can now stay in the house for a while because i didn't have shampoo i didn't have so many things so yeah um let me do like a little haul and then after that i'm just going to do my work because i also ended up not being able to do the work i was supposed to do yesterday and yeah Okay, so I mainly got like hair care products. The first thing I got was this shampoo because let me tell you, I wanted a lot of shampoo and all the other shampoos that were like 700 ml and going up were so expensive. So I just had to settle for, this was like the cheapest 700 ml shampoo. And I know people say this is for white hair, but you know what? It has keratin. It has a lot of things that can also help my hair, but I'll just be trying this out and I'll tell you guys if I like it. I also bought um, this hair pick, let me tell you. I've been looking for this hair pick because what it's supposed to do is it's supposed to help you pick out your hair without like removing curls. For example, if you've done like bantu knots and you don't want to remove your curls, it just helps you pick out your hair so that it can achieve its full volume. I love it. I gotta love it, love it. Everything here I got from Kafo. And then I got this hair oil. It's for type 4 hair and it's supposed to help with hair growth and everything. And again, it was like the cheapest hair growth oil because it was like 300 and the rest were like 1,005. Why are hair products expensive? Like why? <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I got this and I hope it really helps with my growth because I really want to like apply it on my hairline especially. And then I also got this type of lip balm because the one that I have is this one and I feel like it's pretty unsanitary here that every time I need to put lip gloss on my lips, I dip my finger in and then again touch my mouth and uh, no. So I decided to just get this type because I feel like it's more sanitary. And finally, I got like this body scrub that has like gold specks literally it's gold it's so it doesn't smell the best but it's literally a gold scrub i'm sure you can glow after that and then after that i got like face masks of course because it's me <laughs> so i think i'll end the vlog here i'll just i'm just going to go do some work and start editing tomorrow's video so i'll see you guys in the next one if you reach this point of the video comment um shampoo <laughs> i'll see you guys in the next one um i'm really enjoying making a lot of videos for you guys and i'll see you wait i got a hair straightener how could i forget to tell you guys yeah so i got a hair straightener because after staying with my hair for a while i'm sure i'll get tired and i'll just want to wear my wig so i want to try different styles with that wig and yeah i can't wait to show you guys oh, also got something from mrp it's really cute. You guys will see it soon on the gram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, you know, just go follow me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Comment shampoo if you've reached this point. And yeah, bye Tifa.